What's up, people? I'm Arminti and uh, welcome back to another Lumina Legacy video. Guys, in today's video, I'm going to be teaching you ways to save batteries when uh, doing the UMV minigame in Lumina Legacy. So basically, there have been many, many methods to doing the UMV minigame. And in today's video, I feel like after, let's see, I've used around 130 <laughs> batteries when going in the UMV. In Lumion Legacy, and I feel like I may give you one of the best methods there is to use the least amount of batteries and still get the biggest amount of items from the UMV. So make sure to watch the entire video to be an expert uh, when doing UMV after you watch this video. Let me just enter quickly the UMV minigame and I will teach you my method that really has been working a lot lately when I've been doing the UMV. So first things you want to do is go down below and when you're down below you're going to want to minimize the amount of movement because this battery will only go down if you move or if you mine something. Just keep an eye on this while we move. Okay so I moved to here and it barely went down but if I move let's go straight over there. See how it goes down? The more we move the more it goes down and you're going to want to stop at certain places and look around and see if there's places to mine so okay we know we can mine over here and that's the only place to mine so you go there you click here okay now that you're in the mining minigame you're going to want to do the following you're going to want to mine in the shape of a diamond like this as I'm doing and now we can see that we've most likely discovered every single item that there is in this minigame so just prioritize the fossils first you're going to want to prioritize the fossils we know all right off the bat that this over here is a fossil and these two are capture discs so let me just go over the fossil you're going to want to click the light blue rocks because these are the ones that do the most uh effect so click them here click them here and click them here and as you go on there we go we got our first fossil now we have two more discs that we're going to want to mine without filling up the bar so just do as I do like I said click the light blue rocks and see how the biggest amount of damage is done and the biggest amount of uncovering now we have the second disc and now we have a little amount of energy and guys the dynamite is important however you do not want to use the dynamite right now you're going to want to use it as the last thing when you mine I'm gonna teach you how okay so basically mine here mine over here you're going to want to leave to mine like a certain place you know as you see the energy go down you, you don't want to mine randomly just mine at a certain side because that way you can explode the other side with the dynamite basically just click here and now the next time we mine the the energy will go out so now we use the dynamite we just want to include all the space here and boom we use the dynamite and it says all the breed items have been dug up. Obtain a green void stone, a yellow void stone, and a petrolith feather seam. Let me just show you guys how this works also. And look at the amount of battery that we used in this video. I'm going to go through the whole video of uh, mining. So let's continue. Don't, like I said, don't move that much. And just wait in spots and see if you find any yellow star. And if you don't, just move a little to a place you can see a lot of places. So here... Here we can see a star over here and a star over here, so minimize the amount of movement. Now we've gotten here and we're gonna click here. First thing you want to do is mine in the shape of a diamond in the middle. And now we know there's two items that we're gonna want to uncover. First will be the fossil over here, and then will be the capture, well, sort of, sort of disc thing over here. So you, like I said before, try to prioritize the cyan, well the sort of bluish places. And now that we've uncovered that, let's get this disc. Also keep an eye on the energy. You don't want that energy to go down. And as we're going here, boom, we've buried it. We've uncovered both of the items here. And look at our battery, dude. Our battery's barely going down. We know our next spot to go is over here. So try to get a good angle. And okay, now we're here. Like I said before, you want to use the diamond method that I discovered. And boom, we have three fossils here. And we have half energy to do this. So let's be careful about this one guys so as we click on the things make sure to click on the these ones these ones are the most the ones that do the most damage and we've uncovered almost a fossil okay we got one fossil then we have this fossil over here and this one over here i would suggest going for this one because this one is mostly uncovered now and i believe we're gonna need 
almost maybe one more click there we go and now we're just missing this fossil uh, make sure to use the method that I told you guys before just go for a certain side and then leave one side sort of uh, filled up with the rocks then to then throw the dynamite there so now you're going to want to build well click here click here and as you guys can see there's only this side which is covered by the rocks click here and we still got one more click so let's click here and let's throw the dynamite over here and boom we got the three fossils from the from the UMV mining guys UMV is something that you go slow uh, if you see me stream I start to go fast because I basically do my method very fast and when I do my method very fast sometimes I don't get everything okay I'm gonna show you guys how to do the method fast which I don't really recommend doing that uh, so basically it's more of a YOLO site type of situation here where I'm mining very fast and as you can see I'm keeping an eye on my energy and boom dynamite that's basically the fast version but you gotta be really skilled to do the fast version because if you do the fast version you're normally gonna miss stuff okay here we got we have three things a fossil over here fossil over here and a disc over here I'm gonna do the fast method which is basically just sort of YOLOing it uh, not much I don't know if this is a method but yeah, it's basically just sort of a YOLO type situation. Boom! Buried all the buried items have been discovered. Let's keep on moving. Okay, so like I say, you're going to want to stop at certain places. Look at both sides. You see nothing over there, then you keep on moving. You see nothing, neither side, so you keep on moving. Minimize the amount of times you move, because the more you move, the more energy, the more battery you will be losing. So now we find this place. I'm gonna go with the fast method over here. We have a glimmering scale here. We have a fossil over here, and we have a fossil over here. So I'm gonna go first for the glimmering scale, since the glimmering scale is used to evolve uh, Goppy. And yeah, we have the fossils and the glimmering scale. Before leaving this place, I'm gonna check that there's no more places to mine over here. And nope, there are no many more places to mine over here. So let me just keep on moving. Are there places to mine over here? Just wait like five seconds. If you see nothing, look at the other place. Waiting five seconds here. Let's see if anything appears. Nothing appears. So let's just keep on moving. Okay, we found the place here to mine, but don't keep on moving. Make sure to watch literally everywhere you go. Okay, so this is the only place to mine that we can see here. I'm gonna go with the fast method, the diamond, fast diamond. We have two this and a fossil. Always, always, always prioritize the fossils since those are the ones that give you the lumens. So let's just keep on moving. Here we have a star. Let's do the diamond method, and we uncovered two fossils and one void stone. So let me just speed right through this thing to show you guys how to do the fast method and boom it's basically just my umv method i've been using this a lot when doing my umvs in my streams etc and when having just overall fun with the umv i really do hope this method helps you out a lot because for sure it has gotten me a lot of fossils and a little amount of batteries but yeah guys that has been everything for today's video if you guys enjoyed watching make sure to like comment subscribe thank you guys so much for watching this video i'm Arminti and we lit